It's time to step it up. Are you ready? I know you are. Now, here we have a major sort and a minor sort. That means there's more than one sort key. Never two order by statements. One order by statement, and we're going to order by class code descending comma, and then we'll have a minor sort on grade point ascending. And what's that going to do for us? It's going to sort first by the major sort, and that's going to be class code descending. So you'll have the seniors at the top, then you're going to have the sophomores, then the juniors, and then the freshmen because it's alphabetic in reverse order. Those rows won't change unless there's a tie. As you can see, the two seniors are tied, so those rows will take the next sort, which is the minor sort, and it's going to sort by grade point ascending, and the 3.0 is going to be first, and the 3.35 is going to be second. That's a major and minor sort. Here are two examples of one major sort and two minor sorts. Here we're going to order by department number, comma last name, comma salary. Notice that DEPNO is column two, last name's column four, and salary's column five. Notice the other query sorting the exact same way using the numbers. I can even mix and match last name, comma five for salary. I can mix and match those. So whether using the number or you're using the name, it doesn't make any difference. I get a lot of advanced SQL students in my classes, and this is one I set them up on, so they usually miss this. Take a look at this. I'm going to say select everything from student table, order by class code, and as you can see, the null comes first, and then the freshmen's, then the juniors, the sophomores, and the seniors. You see it's alphabetic, but like I tell them, hey, listen, didn't you go to high school? Isn't it freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior? Sort it by that. Freshman, sophomore, junior, senior, and then the null. Could you do it? This is how it's done. I'm going to order by and then use a case statement. As you can see, I've got the case, and there's always an end with every case, and I'm going to case the class code. When freshman, one. When sophomore, two. When junior, three. When senior, four. And else, five. It's going to sort it exactly like we want it to. This lesson is brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. Begin your Teradata journey the right way with our Teradata Basics book. Visit coughingdw.com for more information. Hi, this is Tom Coughing. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please hit subscribe to make sure you are kept up to date on all our videos.